A transformation has taken place. Last spring, a mother orchard mason bee laid a tiny egg inside a mud cell and sealed it shut. Now, 10 months later, a small male bee chews his way free of the cocoon he created for himself last fall. Powerful jaws scrape and cut the inside of the cocoon until he can make a hole just large enough for him to escape. Once he has emerged, the male mason bee will spend his days foraging for nectar, all the while keeping an eye out for the female mason bees who will emerge a few days to a few weeks after him. Competition for females is high, and in this male's hurry to find a mate, he has mistaken another male for a female. Once successful mating has taken place, it's time for the ladies to get to work. And while the males continue to feed themselves and look for more mating partners, the females begin preparing for the next generation. The female spends day after day of the next couple of months collecting pollen, nectar, and mud to build the perfect incubation chambers for her young. And while the rare territorial dispute does break out, mostly these ladies are content to spend their time in such close proximity. As she slowly fills up the tube, pollen, nectar, and a single egg are sealed in individual mud chambers. Female eggs are placed in the rear and male eggs towards the front, guaranteeing the male bees are the first to hatch. And if all goes well, next spring, this year's brood will emerge to begin the cycle again.